Okay, hey everyone, what's up? So today I'm doing a review on the microphone for a moto vlogging setup. So we're gonna do the Sony ECM LV1 uh, stereo lavalier microphone versus the Audio Technica uh, AT9904. Okay, this one's IC recorder, whatever. But uh, as we can see here, let's start with the Sony. This is the first one that uh, you'll hear. I tested out, so uh, just uh, we could see that um, this has a little clip on thing. So unfortunately, uh, this clip on thing, it swivels, but it can't be removed. So maybe, yeah, I'm sure you could just break it off or something. Um, you don't really need it for your helmet setup. Um, but anyways, this one sounds nice. One thing I noticed that uh, when I raised my voice or got excited, you could hear some cracking. Um, but other than that, it sounds pretty good. Okay, uh, this one costs 2,500 yen on Amazon Japan. Um, so yeah, I was a little hesitant to get it because just looking from the picture, and you don't know how big it is, but it's nice and compact and small. It comes with a little uh, microphone cover for the wind noise. It's got the L and R left and right speaker. So yeah, you could just put this on like this. And that protects from the, the wind noise. Okay. Uh, maybe next time, maybe I'll try it this way. Maybe I'm going to break this piece off and because I don't need it. And then uh, maybe it works better this way, facing my mouth directly. Okay, this one. So, uh, yeah, this one's pretty good. This is the Sony. This will be the first one that we tested. Okay, this will be the first one you'll be hearing. All right, and then the second one here, the Audio Technica. So this one is uh, about 3,000 yen. Okay, as you can see, it's nice and tiny, real compact, nice and small. Put on a little wind cover there. Right. And uh, this is the second one you'll be hearing. Okay, yeah. when you order it for your motorcycle, if you use a GoPro like I do, you want to make sure that your jack is comes 90 degree angle, so it, it just goes in like this. If it's a straight kind, you're not going to have enough room between your helmet and the, your GoPro. So this one fits nicely in there. And this one comes with this little piece you can clip on your, your shirt or whatever, which is nice, it just comes off. But we don't need that for our helmet setup though. And it comes with this little case, which is pretty nice, but for five, 500 yen more, I don't really need it, so. But anyways, uh, yeah, this will be the first one that we tested. Like I said, it had a little cracking sound uh, when I raised my voice, got excited. Um, it could be because I, I had it this way. Maybe next time I'll try this way. I'll let you know if there's a difference. Uh, and then the second one you'll be hearing is the Audio Technica. And just for comfort, they're both small. As you can see, this one, obviously, if you don't have much room between your your mouth and your, um, you know, the helmet, um, chin, chin guard, whatever, this one's probably more convenient for the little small spaces if you have a little bit more space you don't mind this one is pretty good so you hear the difference uh well why don't we go ahead and um get on the bike and you can hear it out okay good evening everyone what's up so this is the sony lapel mic it's in uh my helmet now and uh, let's see how it sounds. So uh, let's see. Uh, I have my visor closed. And uh, <clears throat> yeah, hopefully it sounds alright. 
So uh, this mic, as I said before, was uh, about 2,500 yen on Amazon Japan. Um, and like I said, I wasn't quite sure if it would fit in the, you know, in the space between my chin and the front, um, you know, helmet, wearing a full face helmet, but it fits nice. Uh, I just Velcroed it to the, uh, the chin mount and, uh, you know, I can't really feel it. So that's a good thing. Uh, I had another one that was a little bit bigger and every time I, I move my mouth, I, you know, it's because rubbing against my lips. <clears throat> but this one, you can't even tell it's in there, so. Now, between my chin and the, <clears throat> and the front face helmet, full face helmet, the chin guard is, uh, geez, I don't know what you about. Uh, let me stick up my tongue, see if I could touch it. <laughs> uh, it's probably like two or three inches. Hey, what's up everyone? So this is the Sony, the Pell mic. And I wanted to give it a second run because the first one was cracking. It just sounded terrible. And it was just hard for me to believe that, uh, that this product didn't, didn't, uh, you know, the name Sony didn't give it justice, so actually, to be fair, uh, you know, this is this mic isn't uh, wasn't made for motor vlogging. It's made just for you know clipping it on your your suit tie or your shirt, and you know, more like a vlogging or or uh, you know, just talking to your computer or something. So uh, you know, anyway, I decided to give it a second run. Uh, the Audio Technica. It was way better and you'll be able to hear the hear the difference um, yeah this one uh, the first run was just cracking so badly and, and uh, so anyways what I did is the first time I had the the mic taped on uh, you know backwards really um, so what I did this time is I have now the, the speakers facing my lips directly and just right in front of my lips um, I'll probably have to adjust it a little bit because it's actually touching my lips so that's not the most comfortable thing but that could be why it's what's cracking too um, yeah maybe it's just too much too close to the mouth but anyways uh, we'll go ahead and download this stuff and see how it sounds on the computer uh, I'm gonna hit up um, go cruising around a little bit and try to get some um, some good footage with the visor up visor down different speeds go to the tunnel and see how it sounds okay okay next we're gonna hit up a tunnel Dude, it sounds like going through the tunnel. So visors up. Let's close it. Boom. Okay, gonna get some tunnel speeds. How does it sound? Does my voice sound nice and clear coming through the tunnel? Does the Sony do it justice? We'll find out. So, I wonder if the crackling continues. That's too bad. I'm not sure why it's crackling. Well, anyways, this is the Sony and microphone trying to be used as a, a moto vlog mic on the GoPro Hero 8. So, 
this is the the third attempt with this with a minor adjustment the first take uh, the mic was uh, taped on the other way then I was just cracking up a little bit so I uh, turn the mic the other way see if it gets a better result so it's between the two mics the the Sony and uh, oh what's the name of the other one I already forgot audio technica <laughs> audio technica so the audio technica was sounded much clear no cracking no distortion so I guess I gotta recommend the audio technica guys for the nice clean sound hey guys what's up it's the next day and now I'm doing the Audio Technica microphone so I got it installed in my camera the GoPro Hero 8 and uh, I got the windshield down so I, I, as you can see I take off my my uh, my windscreen in the front I usually do that just so I can get a better view but uh, it does you know cause more wind to hit the face that wind that windscreen really does a good job it just blows the wind right over the head so uh, it might be a little more have a little more wind noise than usual but uh, yeah hopefully this audio technica is picking it up pretty good now I noticed on the Sony yesterday um, when I'm speaking with a calm voice it has a really good audio but uh, you know if I raise my voice uh, kind of like you know get excited it starts to uh, pick up some some distortion it starts cracking a little bit so um, yeah that was kind of strange it sounded really good and then anytime I raise my voice a little bit You'll, you'll hear in the audio it starts cracking so maybe this one this one doesn't do that so when we get a little more speed I'll give a little little yeehaw and see how what it picks up <laughs> all right okay we'll wait till we get going here okay so the audio technica runs uh, what was it 3,000 yen so it's about 500 yen more than the Sony one and just from the packaging uh you know it's it's smaller so it fits really comfortably in your helmet that's the first thing you notice nice and compact uh, not that the sony's big the sony fits good um one difference is the little clip thing that you can you know clip on your shirt is not attached to this mic on the sony one it's attached so it didn't seem like it comes off but I'm sure if you want to take it off, you could just, uh, you know, cut it off. You know, you, you don't need it when it's inside your helmet. But uh, that could, you know, save a little extra space. Yeah. I'm like an addict, do I gotta yeah, have it? I ain't even I playing, noticed. got a really bad habit. If it moves, gotta so grab it. Feels like a magnet. Moves won't have it till I'm thrown in a casket. Yeah! Woo, let's pick it up, I ain't baby. playing, got a weird mind. If you work uh, eight hours, I'm gonna work nine. If the shit there. tastes sour, you should taste mine. I'm gonna we'll stay in power for a long time. Get up, nah, I ain't a quitter. Toss me the ball.